Hey, this is David. Today I'm going to show you how to test the terminal block in an electric range with an oven that isn't heating. The terminal block connects the power cord to the internal wiring so electricity can flow into your oven. Before we get started, hit those like and subscribe buttons if you want to join our do-it-yourself repair community and get notified each time we post a new video guide. With over 2 million products in stock and the know-how to help you do it yourself, we are AppliancePartsPros.com. First, we need to get our tools together. Today, we're going to need a multimeter and a quarter-inch nut driver. Also, please remember that safety comes first. Always disconnect your range from power by unplugging it or switching the breaker off before you start working on it. Now, let's get started. If the oven section and the surface elements aren't working, then the problem may be in a burned or damaged terminal block or incorrect voltage going to the range. Go ahead and remove the quarter inch screws that hold the terminal block cover and set it aside. Then look at the wiring at the terminal block, the power cord, and the bake element. If the wiring looks good and you don't see any damage to it, we can do a voltage test. And just a reminder, we're going to test live voltage here, so please be very careful. Set your multimeter to AC voltage, then plug the oven in or flip the breaker back on. Then use the probes to test from the black wire to the white wire. You should be getting a reading of 120 volts AC. When you check from the red to white, you should see 120 volts AC. And when you check from the red to black, the meter should read 240 volts AC. If any of these readings are inconsistent, then the problem has to be with the home wiring, not the range. To fix the home wiring, you'll need to contact a licensed electrician. To reinstall the terminal block cover, use the nut driver to replace the quarter inch screws. If your terminal block is good, check out our other troubleshooting guides that can help you pinpoint the reason why your range isn't heating. If your terminal block is bad, just head over to AppliancePartsPros.com to order a replacement so you can repair your range yourself. And don't forget to share your experience with us in the comments. If this video was helpful, show some love by clicking the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to helping you in the next video.